It means the opening. And it's interesting because in previous scripture, the closest thing that I could find led me straight up to this conclusion because as a Christian, and I was a Christian then, preaching Christianity, it's a beautiful teaching that's coming from the Bible said that Jesus said it. Ask and you'll receive. Seek and you will find. Knock and it will be opened to you. And I could figure the first two, ask. Because I did it, I used to pray. Christians pray. They ask for stuff all the time. And you'll get it. May not be when you want it, the way you want it, but you'll get it. You, something will come to you. That always worked for me. No complaint. Seek and you'll find it. Again, it may not be where you thought it was, but you'll run, it, it, you'll run across it. But what was this knock? What did that mean? I, I know it symbolizes a door and you knock, but why? They even had pictures when I was a kid showing a man, supposed to be Jesus, standing at a door knocking on it. That he's actually knocking too, you know? Knocking. And it will be opened. And then it hit me. You know what? Here's the problem, the heart. I need to straighten out the heart. Let me knock on the heart here a little bit. Let me knock off some of the rubbish and the debris from that thing. Let me get rid of some prejudice here. Let me get rid of some hatred here. Let me clear away the lies. Let me clear away the misconceptions. Let's start with a clean slate. Let's just say I don't know anything at all. Zippo, zero, just like when I was a baby. Start with what? One thing. God guide me. Let that be your litmus test. And remember, that's exactly what every single woman interviewed in all of those countries that we mentioned. They all said the same thing. Because Allah guided me.